look, I put myself on the pedestal. This is incredible. Take your fandom to the next level with the official Grizzlies app. Go all access and behind the scenes. It's got to be heavy defense. That's where it starts for us. Personalized to where you are and who you are. Get easy access to ticketing, the game day guide, and your own app customization right at your fingertips. Upgrade your experience and download the Grizzlies app today. Justin Timberlake. I'm sexy back. The Forget Tomorrow World Tour. I can't stop like Live in Memphis. Justin Timberlake. FedEx Forum, Saturday, November 23rd. Get tickets this Thursday at 10 a.m. at LiveNation.com. The brand new single, Selfish, is available to stream and download now. Oh, if I get jealous, I can't help it. For more, hit up JustinTimberlake.com. Don't worry, be fluffy world tour. The minute you get into a brand new relationship, like magic, you know who really notices just how happy you are, guys? Other women, not your woman. Look how happy he is. Oh, I bet I can change that. Friday, May 10th, FedEx Forum. Get your tickets now at fluffyguy.com. Don't miss a Memphis. Don't worry, be fluffy world tour. We were without internet from 11 in the morning until what ended up being around 8 o'clock at night. I'd be the first to go in an apocalypse. I just would not even know what to do. Chris is over here like, who needs internet anyway? Let's just be one with the land. And I'm like, frantic. I'm like, I can't do anything. Tune in to the Jessica Benson Show with CJ Hurt live every weekday at 8 a.m. on YouTube at Grind City Media and the official Grind City Media app. It's time to kick back, relax, and get fired up about fits. Grind City Media presents the show about sneaker culture, the latest trends, and all the fashion you can handle. It's Tuesday. Joining us live inside FedEx Forum and the GCM Studios. Get ready to kick it with Kelsey, Jerry, Sherman, and Adam. Welcome to... And I'll put that on game. The Sneak Fest Show. Nah, homie, I don't bang, but I'll put that on game. Welcome to the Sneak Fest show, everybody. It is Tuesday. We are live right outside of the FedEx Forum, ready to talk about sneakers. The rest mm -hmm. of the gang is not here, but two of them are. Sherman, mm -hmm. Jerry, what mm -hmm. up, what up? Good afternoon, everybody. What up, what up? We survived that thunderstorm. Yes, that oh, was crazy. Oh, my, my dog almost didn't. That was crazy. I woke up at 7.30 this morning. I thought, oh, I thought it was you. still nighttime, how dark it was outside. Oh, lucky you. I woke up to my dog like <laughs> sitting on my, never mind. Uh, let's start off with a big congratulations to you guys because you had a yes. sneak fest yes, we did. event yes. Yes. in Nashville. I yes. have a picture of you guys out there. Um, if you guys want to give a quick thank you to everyone who came, tell me about it. What sure. happened? The good, the uh, it bad. Was dope. It was dope. It you know, was. it's always a fun time in Nashville. Oh, yeah. Um, Shout out to Nashville. Maybe man. explain to everyone, just in case they think this is just a show. Okay. No, yeah, yeah, Explain yeah. what happened. Go ahead, Jerry. So, you know, we host a sneaker convention as well, and we were in Nashville this past weekend. This, partnered this, up with this the year makes 10 years Yeah. since, that, we, since yeah. our first show Crazy. that we ever did, our ever first show. So, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And this past show was number 18. Number eight, 18 or 19 out of two I've years. I've lost count. Yeah. And so what happened? Someone walks in and what? Go yeah, ahead, you go in and shop shop around different vendors that we've recruited throughout from the all US. over yeah, yeah. south carolina can, you know, new york it's like a one-stop shop yeah you know you can get some clothes it's customized i sneakers. saw that you guys posted those friggin croc oh yeah <laughs> the, the big, big yellow croc boots were there yeah <laughs> well, that, when um, i saw them i thought about you i said there was uh, somebody was actually wearing the big red boots yes shout um, out to brian mm -hmm. real ones yeah uh, I, don't, I don't know i can't tell yeah well, i thought you had someone to um, oh yeah, well, yeah. We had an authenticator. That yeah, was the first yeah. time we've had an oh, authenticator. Shout out to Rome, man. Yeah, she came out. She came out from New York. We come, mm -hmm. we hit her up, and she was excited to come down. And like Good she vibes. came down, yeah. She was like, I love it. She yeah, we like, were telling people don't bring the fakes, but she caught. I, I watched her catch like three or four. Oh pairs yeah, she of caught fakes. three or four. The thing yeah. is. Yes. I feel a little bit bad because what if she's catching these people, but they didn't know either? Because we've talked yeah. about this on the show. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. You can buy something from StockX and it could be fake. Yeah. So, yeah. If, so you're not even catching them. You're like, right. unfortunately, breaking the bad news. So what yeah. can happen is, like, if she authenticated your shoes and you bought some from Jerry and you're still at this at the events. I got you. If I, you still have time to go back to Jerry. Punch it's like, hey, mm -hmm. not punching <laughs> <laughs> But like, hey, 
this authenticator, which one happened to a vendor, yeah, yeah. and the yeah, vendor walked me. back up. Went nope. the vendor walked back over there with the guy, and he was trying to explain to me. I'm like, sir, I'm not authenticated. You got to talk to the mm -hmm. lady who's who's the expert at this. Like, like <laughs> most of the most of the people were like, ah, oh, dang, yeah, like you know what I mean, like. Yeah. They didn't buy them there. They brought them to yeah, they, get yeah, they brought. Yeah, a lot of them brought them in. Yeah, they brought to, them yeah. to get It was only one that bought it from another vendor and brought it up there yeah, to her. And it was just like, oh, well, they, they mended what they had to mend. There was no, you know. Yeah, and she was good, too. Like, anything, she was good. So two thumbs up? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes. Success. Shout out. Mm -hmm. Oh, and then shout out to Jelly Roll for coming through, man. Like, he, whew, I think he had the biggest buyout in Sneak Fest hit, history. What? Like. Just one of the big, yeah, just as like not at not to resell, but just no, not to buy. resell. I'm yeah. talking about just to buy. He bought yeah. like a whole like laundry hamper, yeah, thing. Of yeah, shoes. we had to live because he was just going by each table. like okay, he was looking Anything for a size, size 13, 13 for himself. Mm -hmm. His wife was a women's seven, seven and, a and a half, and his daughter was a men's eight, which mm -hmm. is a women's nine and a half. Mm -hmm. and he was like, anything y'all can find with them three sides, I'm buying that it. I don't already what have. I don't already have. So he was just like going through needed, each table. He needed all three, like he wanted matching shoes, or no, like no, no, just no, whatever, no, he just whatever, yeah, whatever that size. Yeah, was but size. if they did have matching shoes, it was a plus for him because he mm -hmm. was like, hey, yeah. when we have daddy daughter time or family time, yeah. all of us can wear the same shoes like together. A, give me a highlight of some of the shoes that he bought. He bought. I'll shout out to all. Powerpuff Reliable Girls. Souls because he bought a lot from Reliable Souls. Mm -hmm. So he bought the Powerpuff Girls. Powerpuff Girl Dunks. He bought the he SB, bought of... SB4s. He bought the... Uh, yeah, he did buy SB4s. He bought a bunch of Jordan 1s. Yeah, he bought he bought his... Um, his he donated a lot of stuff. Oh, well, yes. not a lot of stuff, but he donated donated to some foundations. Yeah, shout out to uh, so. Creator Girls Rock too. Yeah, he, yeah. He, he, he made a big contribution to them. Mm -hmm. uh, the Titans had a um, auction up for to go yeah, to like their different to, memorabilia, yeah, yeah, memorabilia. So he, he went and bought a lot table. of stuff from there uh he bought his daughter the uh reverse mocha travis got lows um yeah he was just you couldn't he, have slid in a, a pair of those yeah he was just, just he was just buying like whatever yeah. this okay cool i want i want i want i want it like and he me, stopped to take pictures of every fan every fan even he, the fans that were shy yeah he, he told them, "Come on over." I'm not, like he saw it. it in their face. He was like, "You want to take a picture? Come on." They was yeah. like, "You sure?" It was like, "Yeah." We were trying to wrap up. And like, no, the security get him out. was. The security was like, "You gotta go." He was like, yeah, "I don't want to go." Yeah, to, took pictures of everybody. So. <laughs> That's really cool. Yeah. It, it yeah. went from him supposed to only being there for like 30, 40 minutes, so he was there right. for like two hours. Yeah. <laughs> That's cool. Yeah. So shout out to Jelly Roll, man. Shout out to Tay Keith. Uh, shout out to DJ Q. Man, just shout out to Nashville in general, man. Yeah, everybody else should look. Shout yeah. out Nashville. Yes, mm -hmm. yes. Shout out Nashville. Yes. Oh, one more thing before we start. We okay. got to get a congratulations to our brother Adam. Oh, yeah. He crossed over yesterday. He became a capo. So he's been, he's had a long couple of months. So that's why he's not here today. We told him to take a rest, enjoy, enjoy his time off. So congratulations to that for becoming a capo on yesterday. So congratulations, sir. All right. You guys ready to start? Let's mm -hmm. do it. All right. We have Let's some fun. Do it. Keep it or kick it, uh -oh. gentlemen, this week. Uh-oh. So everyone knows it's my favorite segment. We're going to go right yes. into it. Yes. Bennett, will you be our... Oh, shout uh, out to Bennett, man. Welcome back, Bennett. Oh, oh, look, I got a microphone today. Welcome back, Bennett. Oh, hey. oh, oh, hey. oh, oh, hey. oh, shout Let's out to Bennett. You'll be the tiebreaker. Ooh. Sounds good. All right. We've got Bruce Brown on the left. Okay. We've got DeAndre Ayton on the right. I am. This is easy for me. I'm going Bruce Brown. Bruce Brown? Is that an honor to give shirt he rocking or something in there? Let me look. Hold on. I like who you got, Jerry? Bruce Brown. Okay. On the left. Uh, his shirt just says cherries. Okay. I'm rocking with Bruce Brown. I like that. Yeah. I like that. Bruce outfit. Brown? Yeah, yeah. I like that. All outfit. right. Bye, DeAndre. Sorry, Next up, DeAndre. we've got Dwight Powell. You know, I always try and just slide him in there. Huh. I like it. I like it too. It gives me that uh, Jimi Hendrix type of vibes with the, the long neck, the long neck shirt on that one with the cardigan. I think I'm going to roll with that. I think I'm gonna think I'm gonna roll with that outfit. This one's tough for me because I do like it. Yeah, both both of them is good outfit. But I don't like it more than Bruce Brown. We have our first time. Our first yeah. time. Benny Bear. Mm. Benny, what you rocking with, Benny? Yeah, honestly, I think I'm gonna go with Pal because I Powell? like the cardigan. Like yeah, the I don't like Bruce Brown's pants. Okay. Too tight. No, no, no. It's not the. I don't know. Some like throw me off of about them. The shape, the shape, I feel like the, 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 the bottom of them, the cuff needs to be a little, little right, tight around the shoes. All right, you guys are gonna love this one. <laughs> Dwight Powell versus GP2. Oh, uh, I'm staying Powell. with Dwight. I like the pants. The 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 the. the, the you G guys are seriously looking at Gary Payton. 
the G unit or whatever. The G unit tank top is throwing me off. <laughs> you should just wore a t shirt. You look so good. You like that? Yes. Well, you I forgot you do like you do like shirtless. Arms out, chest yeah, out, you, you thighs do like out. that. I forgot that. Yeah. Are you guys joking? Yeah, we're, jo- we're, not, like the, we're not joking. Yeah, we're I'm serious. not joking. Hmm. The Pooh Shice are mad, so hmm. I'm not with that one. Well, be careful because we have one on OMG coming up. Uh oh. Okay. Oh, sure. Ah, <laughs> good one. Okay, Dwight okay. Powell versus Lugan Stork. Oh, oh that's, nope, Malik I was like, Monk. Oh, Malik. That's Malik Monk. Malik got Malik the whole Monk. No Limit Soldier outfit on. You no know what's crazy? And that, I know I'm anti set, but I like it. I don't like that. I like it. That's a set I can say I don't like. I'm going with, I'm staying with Powell on this okay, one. Okay, tiebreaker. Okay, Powell or Dort? Uh, no, that was Malik. That was Malik. I, I like, I'm I like, Malik. wait, 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 go back. Go back. Go back. <laughs> I, like, I like Malik. I like the sneakers. You like Malik? Okay. Yeah. Okay, we're going to keep Malik and get rid of Dwight. Okay, yeah, sorry, Dwight. I try to keep you in there. I try to keep you in oh, there. Oh, we just skipped Lou Dort altogether, you guys? No. Okay. No, no, he came back. That's him, right? No, this no. is Nikhil Alexander Walker. Oh. oh. I like his fit. I like the kill fit. Is that the is that the, are those the, the products? Is that the front the like is that the W the double hoodie or whatever triple they call hoodie. it? The triple hoodie? I like it. You like that? I like yep. that. I like it too. His socks, I like how they're ruffled. The product yeah, what's the product yeah, shoes? The what's the name of the product shoes? Um I forgot the name of the, the tennis shoes. They're yeah. Products yeah. Sneakers, yeah, I forgot the name. They're they're product starting cups, to come back now. Sports the sports cups like or whatever it's called. Yeah, yeah they're mm-hmm. starting to come back. I'm I'm rocking with that. Nikhil? Yeah, I'm rocking with Nikhil. Yeah, I'm rocking Nikhil. All right. That's a fresh outfit, though. Nikhil versus Obi Toppin. Mm, with the Travis on, the Fragment Lows. Look like a minimum L.A. shirt. Mm. I like how the Nikhil color- has his put together. I more. like that one. I'm with you on that one, Jerry. Yeah. We, rock, we stay on Nikhil. Nikhil? On yeah. All right. Nikhil versus yeah. Wemby. Ooh. Same. Uh, LV I'm, outfit? I'm rocking with has Nikhil. It has outfit. to be. Only thing that I would say, Vic, if he didn't have what well, I don't yeah, I don't have anything against pandas. He just got the pandas on with their own outfits. You do have something wrong. Like you always have something Not me. To say about pandas. Not me. I love pandas. I'm always I'm for pandas. I mean, I'm on the same right page. Now. That's Jerry that didn't, they didn't like pandas. I wear them though. And then Jerry bought pandas for his entire family. Exactly, so. right, right. Yeah, but so we're gonna sometimes stay with, you gotta do what you gotta do. We're gonna Nikhil? stay we're gonna stay Nikhil. with Nikhil. All right, yeah, Nikhil yeah. versus Russ. I'm going with Russ on this one. I like that outfit. I'm sticking with Nikhil. I'm staying with I'm going to All right. Mm. Another Nikhil or Russ. This is a good matchup. This, this is a good I matchup. I feel like that Russ has had way better. He has. I like the, I like the Nikhil jacket. I yeah, do. I'm the, triple Nikhil. the triple hoodie? I'm yeah. a fan of it. Yeah. The triple like hoodie? It. Triple All right. Clean. Nikhil wins this one. Now, Nikhil. This is actually he, um, the game right before us. This uh-huh. is Harry Giles the third. Okay. This is my friend. I have worn this brand before. It's called Do Not Disturb. I like that brand. My friend Ferris out of Atlanta. Shout out, shout out to the brand, I'm going to kill. I really yeah. like that set, that that whole, yeah. the way everything now, flows. They look like some minimum L.A. shorts he got on, too. I think those are minimum L.A., but yeah, I'm staying, I'm going to kill on those as well, All too. right, Nikhil versus Jabari Walker. Hmm. It's okay. Nikhil. Yeah, I'm staying with Nikhil on that one. What I don't about his shoes? I don't understand the, the, the those, uh, North, the USC fours with the shirt. I don't are know those USC those. fours or those like the, the green, gray, craft joints? No, no, no. no. They, those okay, are blue ones. Yeah, those are blue ones. I'm, I don't understand that with the shirt that he's wearing. Okay. <laughs> Nikhil versus <laughs> Jalen Williams. Those boots. Can't stand those boots. These boots are made yeah, for walking. Come on, Jerry. You, you got quiet on that with Jerry. You I, know, you, you can't. I like the I like the top quiet, side. Yeah, everything no, everything weighs down. I'm not for it. So yeah, I'm saying the kale on this. Yeah. One. See, you know what's crazy about Jalen? He I, has good style. He does. He does. Yeah, I he really actually does. Hate opposite of you. I like everything from the waist down, and I don't like his little. Really? Vest. I like the. I like the. Oh. I don't like the little vest. The I vest like with the, the long pants sleeve. just went all the way down. I like that the pants don't. I actually think the the bottom half of that outfit is fire. Now, if he if his pants were a little not so long, if they were a little shorter, like how Dylan would wear them, I think I would have okay, won first with those. of all, it wouldn't, they'd be a lot shorter if they were how Dylan would <laughs> <Yeah. them. laughs> Dylan was, Dylan has a thigh tad, right? He no. would, oh, no, he, he don't, he just, has, he's he's just big thighs. thighs. He's, he's just like, where thighs are short. Oh. That's, that's what I'm saying. I don't I'm know, I like of. the length of them, honestly. Like the like, I think this is a cool outfit. I feel like it's just like, hey, yo, his stylist was like, look like a biker, and that's what he came out with. I don't, and he pulled it off. Yeah, he pulled, he, he pulled it off, but I'm standing, yeah, we're standing to kill Nikhil versus Jeremy Grant. Nikhil. Is that a skirt? No. It's not a skirt? No, it's shorts. That was just shorts. Honestly, what it looks like, and I wish I could show you guys, is like a pair of pants upside down. So like oh, the button and the zipper, I don't know if you okay. can see it on his knee. I yeah. see it now. I do see it now. It's I, very avant-garde. 
It's very runway. I don't know. Runway. I, I like this. I don't like it to wear, but I like because it's different. Mm-hmm. So I'm going I'm to roll with that out. I'm going to roll You're with that Jeremy? out. Yeah, I'm going Jeremy on this one. It's different. It's, it's a, I like it. Yeah, I'm, I'm with you. I, I like every outfit pretty much that I yeah. pick for this. Yeah. You segment. always do. Uh, Bennett. Bennett got a time break of Bennett. Mm. I know I'm gonna stick to Keel. I actually like the previous guy's outfit. Mm. Uh, who was it again? The, uh, okay. You like the Thunder? Thunder? Yeah, 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 okay. yeah. I like okay. his. So Benny's gonna stay with Nikhil. Stay with Nikhil. Yeah. All right, Nikhil versus James Harden. A little Rough Rider. Love the Rough Rider T-shirt. I mm. love it. I, we've seen we've and seen his, some some his, some some bad hard his outfits. Pants, I don't know if you can tell, but they are like covered in like black crystals. Yeah. Oh really? That's pretty, yes. I think I'm going James Harden. Okay. And he has the Louis Vuitton a, shoes on. Jerry's favorite shoes that he tried to buy this past weekend. Man, <laughs> somebody had them in my size too. I think I'm gonna stay with James on this one. James too. Harden. Yeah, yeah, I'm staying with James. I like the Rough Rider T-shirt. James, it's oh, hard. Two old school guys. James Ooh, Harden versus PJ Tucker. PJ. Yeah, AJ, oh. you know we're a fan of the the varsity I'm a fan with the of that shorts. Whole look. And that whole look is just because I clean. wouldn't wear that whole look. I'm going with PJ on this one. Uh, I'm going. With I PJ. really like James Harden's outfit though. I'm going, I'm going with stick PJ. With James Harden. I'm going with PJ, and he got Ooh. the ones on. Okay, tiebreaker. I'm going PJ. Tiebreaker. Yeah, tiebreaker. Mm. Tie what you got, Bennett? Mm. I think, got, I think the Rough Riders tee gets Rough hardened tea? over the top. I yeah. need to get one before the yeah. summer. Yeah, I'm with you on that one. You like James? Yeah, like James. I want the rough, I want to get the rough ride tee and then cut it, cut it off. You show, would show yeah. them. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Arms out. CLA or PJ. Sorry, PJ. All right, Canada's finest. Yeah. RJ Barrett. Yeah, it's basic. I'm staying with. That's the word. Basic. Sometimes basic is classic. You know? Sometimes classic. it is. Like this is a good like you know date night outfit. I'm going James Harden though. Yeah, I'm James on this one. James versus Scoot. <laughs> you want to talk about something that's not basic? I'll give you not basic. <laughs> James oh, Harden. Jerry, you tell me you you want to go with it? I'm just like I don't like that outfit. Jerry said mm, it's a little basic. I said okay, hold on. <laughs> Scoot Henderson on the phone. Oh, hey, that outfit is not basic. Did I Jimmy- see why he has a che- hot Cheetos collab now. <laughs> Who's we'll saying with James? Because it's hot? <laughs> it's because it's hot. <laughs> it's a hot outfit. It is. He I looks like, like Chester right now. He looks like Chester the cheese on Who, this one. What are your votes? I'm staying with James. James on this. I don't know what happened to my Crazy. chair. I know. James versus my arch nemesis. You know, I like this outfit. Vanessa Sanchez-Kumpo. <laughs> I like it. Don't you? You have a pair of pants like this. I do. You yeah. do. She I had do. them on what, These are a couple actually shows. Them. That's why you're the same arch He took your I pants. I borrowed them from Sound by right. What am I having uh, on my chair? Uh, that's not a bad fit, but. I'm staying James. I'm James staying James Harden. on this one. Bad I don't know what happened to my chair. James versus James. Tory Craig. James. Is that Louis Vuitton? We don't matter. I, no. I like this outfit. That's I'm, crazy. I'm going with that. I, I like actually that. picked this one to like make fun of Tory Craig. Really? Yeah, I, I like that. He looks All like right. Dennis Rodman almost. He does look like Dennis Rodman. James or Tory? I think James. James? I think James. James. Uh, I, don't, I don't know what's going on in the other one. <laughs> James. It's over my It's over my head. <laughs> Sorry, Tor. This one you guys really had to take a hold look on, at. Hold yeah. on, hold on, hold yeah. on. So we I brought up JC, and I wanted you to, before you spoke, to like really look at what he's wearing. I mean, he's wearing the mischief boots. No, he, he wore the, 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 the double jeans. They're probably mischief jeans. <laughs> what? You guys love the triple Wait. hoodie, so don't talk smack I wonder, about you know, Jordan honestly, Clarkson's double I wonder jeans. if he could choose which set of legs to put them in. This know? is interesting. What brand, what brand is this? You don't even know? It's probably the this, same brand that KJ was just looking at to buy some pants That is different. <laughs> that is this. This is a hard one for. I'm gonna see what the chest. You know, say. if it wasn't the quad leg jeans, what that's a good saying? outfit. If it wasn't for the uh, quad so legs, so wide at the bottom. Hold on, everyone. Hold Let's on. Let's see. Uh, Nick said they are uh, Levi the uh, five Levi's five leg jeans. <laughs> <Five-legged> jeans. <laughs> yeah, exactly. This this is fashion. This is Paris fashion. We yeah, those sure. are those aren't Levi five hundred ones. They're Levi those are definitely not five hundred ones. Those are the five tens. <laughs> No, Five. 10 02s. Ten, <laughs> what are your votes? Oh, uh, James. <sighs> Ooh. Come on, Sharp. I'm going to go James. Oh. I'm going to go James. Would you have voted for Jordan? I think I was going to change it. I want to do I'm going yeah, Jordan. Clarkson. I was about to say that too. Okay. I'm going to go Jordan on this one. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, sorry. Wait, it went from two James to two James. Yeah, I was about to go Jordan. I don't know what James was. Yeah, let's do it. We're going Jordan. What would your vote have been? 
As a former Jinkos wear, I would have gone. I would have gone Jordan. I would have gone Jordan. <laughs> I like. I like that the Jinkos are coming back. Oh, JC just went from zero votes yeah, to three. Yeah, yeah, he did. Shout out to JC. Shout out JC. It's, it's different. I, I like it. I okay, like, I, I know like who it. you guys are gonna pick now because you love them so much. No, I'm going. I'm sticking with Jordan. Clarkson. I'm staying with Jordan on this one too. I've se- we've I am s- shocked. We've seen some Bella LeBron outfits in this am one. Shocked. This one. I, I like the jacket. The jacket is fire. Yeah, I'm but not a fan. The uh, everything I'm sure there was a uh, Louis V sneakers that he has on. If he has a, mm-hmm. yeah, they I think are. those are the new pair. They're like they're like almost boots. Yeah, uh, I don't like that don't outfit. Like it. it didn't. It, it's not flowing well. By LeBron. Saw LeBron. Tyler Hero. Ooh, mm-hmm. you got the Asics on. Are those Asics or the, uh, or CDs? They look like. They might be Vomeros or so. Is he a Nike player? No, those are not Romero. I like the Maybach truck they behind like them. Uh, I'm thinking JC. Thinking JC. Okay, I'm yeah. saying with JC. I like this outfit though. Outfit. It looked like he's in a rap video. JC versus Halliburton. <laughs> this jacket. What is up Who, with the jacket? Who's his stylist? <laughs> we have some questions. <laughs> I'm going JC. He needs to his call. His fits have been bad lately. He needs to call Tony. Tony, you need to get the cut set with with uh with Tyler Fast, but uh yeah I'm staying. Tyrese JC. Halliburton, yeah he yeah. is uh yeah I'm staying some, JC on this one. Where's he been shopping lately? <laughs> like his fits lately has just oh been do you know what? What's that? There's this article I'm reading that came out. His shoes are. I like his ago. shoes though. He shares his fashion journey. Oh, never mind. Yeah, I read it wrong. <laughs> yeah. uh, there is no fashion. I don't journey. know what's going on. <laughs> so with, get rid of him. I don't yeah, know yeah, what's yeah, going yeah, on yeah. with that outfit right now. Like, yeah. is, I don't know. Yeah. Sorry, JC. JC, 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 for the people in the chat that hasn't watched us or do watch it, we have a certain we have certain players that we have to a high standard when it comes to fashion. Jordan Clarkson, Shay, Shay, Dylan, Dylan. Jason Tatum, Kuzma, Kuzma, mm-hmm. Trip. Yeah, but he doesn't get judged. Yeah, he, yeah. he don't get judged because he, he has his own segment. Yeah, yeah. 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 So um, it's, we yeah. missing some. It's like I'm sure we missing somebody or two more. That feels like. It's like it felt like is it? Guys, doesn't it? I feel like we missing somebody. There's one. There's one that's. I think he plays from Minnesota. Who? I don't know. Yeah, but well, uh, for sh- off the top of our head, those are the five that we that kind of get held yeah, to a higher yeah, we had them to so a higher standard. So it does take a lot yeah. for JC to win. Yeah, exactly. Because exactly. he's held higher yeah. than everyone yeah. else. Yeah, 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 for sure. That's well, a good fit, though. Congratulations, yeah. congratulations, Jordan. JC. We hadn't seen Jason in a while. He had, he had, really, yeah, we he had, had no. Fine, good. I'll put him back in. <laughs> I've been being a hater. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, all right, because we talk about all the other guys in the league and we give a little hate, a little love. Let's yes. give some love to some stuff that our guys wore. These are all from yesterday. This is Jaron Jackson Jr. coming nice. into the arena. Uh, just getting ready to put 40. Oh, yeah. 40 up on the scoreboard. Jaron Jackson Jr. dripped out in diamonds from head to toe. That's and crazy. we will talk about his tunnel fit, of course. Mm-hmm. He always wears the same playing shoe. Yes. But today we get a new little colorway. Those are, those are I nice. tried to look up the style number or color code or whatever for the GT runs, but you can he have, has so many pairs. I bet you they don't even just I make them for the masses. I think those are just just for him. Yeah, they don't make them for the masses. Yeah. So. so what's the shoe if someone's it's watching It's the, the Nike time. GT run. Nike GT, yeah, Nike yep. GT run. And from the look of the outsole, it has the Nike React. Oh, it's it's a Nike Zoom. 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 Air Zoom on. Yep. Um, so is, is him and Victor... The only two that the Victor wears is where Victor is wears a different variation. Do you guys? Are oh. calling Wembenyama? Yeah. Don't see where it is. This? I don't know, but the weird. The, it was weird that you guys called him by his first name, like your friend. Oh, okay. <laughs> that was yeah. weird. I didn't hey, understand. I mean, that's my guy. I was like, that's do you guys his... mean Vince? Yeah. No, Victor. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's always in GT runs. Yeah, Vic's so. my guy. I ain't never yeah. met him before, but Vic, Vic's my guy. <laughs> uh, okay, and what about his tunnel fit? Clean. It's hard. I like that's it. hard. Like, are you saying all those are diamonds? Like well, straight up? Like that's whoever. I'm sure no one did this by hand, but if you did, like, you I are mean, very I'm sure that's done by hand. It might yeah. be done by hand because by hand. Z's girlfriend does stuff by hand, so. I sure does. Mm-hmm. I forgot about that because mm-hmm. Kelsey had some on. Mm-hmm. Good. That is yeah. true. So it could that's be done by hand. That's a good fit, though. It is nice hoodie. Fit. Everything flows well. Would, would it have beaten Jordan Clarkson's? It wouldn't have been nah, Jordan nah, nah, nah. Is it chill fit? Because they're in nah, Detroit. Yeah. And he's yeah. out of town. It's not like LA. Yeah. 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 And I think we noticed that about him, too. I think it depends on the city they're in. It seemed like 
different. The way they come into the tunnel is what is totally different in the mm -hmm. in each city. So shout out to Trip, man, for that forty piece last night. Mm -hmm. and the All dub. right, let's go to our next guy. We were talking about the <laughs> G -G. The G -G. This is GG Jackson G -G. again, a very chill fit, but yeah. I felt like we had to give him a shout out today because of the mask. He took a selfie with the mask. I don't know if you guys saw on his Instagram yeah. earlier. So I was like, you know what? He likes it. We like it. Mm -hmm. What do you think, Jerry? It's tr the mask is trendy. It's like an extra accessory now, yeah. you know, like what else can I incorporate with my outfit? Yeah. And, you know, it flows well. He had a good game yesterday, too. So I'm just I'm just it's just funny that the mask just became the poo shiesty mask now. Yeah, like, it just became the poo yeah, shiesty mask, but it's been, shiesty, you know, but it's been uh, around uh, forever. Yeah, for like, skiers, yeah. snowboarding, you know. When we go ATV, that's what I, I have on my head. Mm -hmm. I was wearing that before poo shiesty was wearing it. So, yeah. but no, I did you with the with the tote bag and some slides with some slides on. Mm -hmm. He looked like he he's like, mostly about comfort. Nike SB yeah, slides. Yeah. I wonder if they're more comfortable. Like, you know, oh, those like, are SB slides. Mm -hmm. Oh. Okay, and I didn't his notice that. Serious player he, only. He got his you know? uh, he got his phone charger in there. Make sure he didn't leave that out. <laughs> of course, he's not gonna forget his phone charger. <laughs> he's eighteen. What you yeah. respect? Nineteen. He's nineteen. Nineteen. Yeah. 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 Sorry, yeah. yeah. sorry, yeah. sorry, yeah. sorry, All right, so we get asked this a lot yeah. every time I'm at games. I know when you guys are at games, they're mm -hmm. like, "What is he wearing? Are yeah. they Puma? Are they whatever?" We've talked about it a time. The brand is called Serious Player Only. Serious mm -hmm. player These only. are the player ones. Yep. This is like a watermelon neon pink color. Does it have a name? Their names are like they're, it's they're, crazy. They just I don't know. Yeah, they just come over there. Done. This is candy. Candy. <laughs> that might be it. That might be because yeah. you said that on one of the pairs, and yeah. Adam looked it up. It was all oh, that is a name. So what was that? The I'm last the, serious player the last players. home game he came out in the Kyrie's Antas. He played the first quarter or the first half in them. And second half, he went right back to the. Yeah, only, went, went, baby. Back to, he had a mismatch too, so I don't even know what what shoe that was. Mm -hmm. So, so there's a pink colorway on there right now that says Coco Pink, but mm. those might be it. Yeah, Coco cool. Pink. There you go. He loves to play in them, so like same way with Trip and and Bane, they comfortable in them, so they he found just their run shoe. No, let's the next guy we have. Uh, the next guy is Santi Aldama, and Santi? when I look at the most recent pictures mm -hmm. it is the same shoe this is not it i had to go back uh -huh. he's worn the same shoe we've talked about it a billion times so i was season. like you know what we're going mm -hmm. old school and yeah. i'm picking a different shoe yeah. <laughs> this is not from a recent game because oh, we have okay. talked about that shoe yes. too dang much that, gray pair, that yeah. gray pair this is the, also a Giannis, mm -hmm. but this is the immortality 2 mm. mint green colorway yeah okay. so, so the immortality 2 is probably like you know how jordan had the numbered ones and then there's like a team lineup mm -hmm. Like oh. this is Giannis's team yeah, version. Team. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. I did. And almost every, for us. every signature athlete has like a team line now too, pretty much. Really? Mm hmm Huh. All right. So maybe Ja might be getting one soon. Period. We'll see. Might. We get into existence. Mm -hmm. Um yeah, so I chose the shoe. It was old. It's obviously not what he's wearing. We've right. just talked about that shoe so that dang gray much. Pair. Yeah. Like yeah. it wasn't even a new color where I was like, I'm not <laughs> doing he it. He loves it. He loves that gray Giannis. <laughs> but I wanted yes. To bring him on here because one, he's been playing well, and two, yeah. this was kind of an interesting shirt to me, and I wanted yeah. to hear what you guys had to say. Would you would you wear this? The hoodie? Yes. That, it's fine. I like it. It reminds me of a um of a dragon fruit. So yes. I think mm -hmm. on Nike's site, I think I'm, I'm, I think it was a different color, but it's a whole outfit like that. The pants are made like Where that and like everything. Emboss swooshes around. No, 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 cuts. no. Those are holes. Those are holes. Yeah, those are holes. Those are, you can see his shoulder. Yeah, they, yeah, those are holes. Uh, yeah, those those are holes. Uh, oh. I thought. Oh yeah. No, those I are fine now. With the uh, Nike dunks, I don't know what dunks he wearing. Those might be the fish. You know, it's because he's like, like the man, fish dunks. I've been in Memphis for a while now. <laughs> I don't know if it's gonna be hot or cold. <laughs> so I'm gonna wear the hoodie that allows air to come in but he in was in the uh out. he was in detroit he, this was detroit it was last night right yeah mm -hmm. but he yeah you're right you're right, you're right. yeah those are yeah those are hoes right. it's a whole outfit like that so is it on the line right is it on uh, the line i'm trying is it to, on the internet right now <laughs> hold on let me see uh i'm trying to find it let's see that's a good fit though i think everybody has, a, to find it? has a pair yeah. of jeans that same wash that what that same wash you know like light denim color so yes oh yeah they are yeah so nike yeah. has it's, it's unisex as well too so it's a pink one hold on what's it's the price one so the hoodie so the hoodie is one night it's a collab uh with I, i'm not for the mess up her name <laughs> come on Devin does it i'm, I'm definitely do it. not for the mess up her name. but yeah it's 190 for the hoodie and it's pink and hey. the pants 
Jacquemus. <laughs> Jacquemus. Yeah. Oh, yeah. it's like a designer. Yeah. Uh -huh. This is a designer collab. Yeah. So it's, oh, wow. it's, it's some different colors on there. Uh, let me see if hmm. I can find the pants. If the pants come up. Not bad. So they, it comes in red. It comes in pink and brown. I think the brown one will be dope. Let's see what what's the price on? Oh, it's still the, the hoodie is this is just it's still just showing the hoodie. So that one's that's the red one. I have the pants here. The that's pants are one hundred and seventy five dollars. So the pants is one seventy five and the hoodie is one ninety. But so. the pants, if you want the brown ones right now, is only large and extra large. Yeah. Yeah, that pink one is only, I think it's only large size in that pink one, so. The pants are kind of sick. Yeah, the pants are nice. So the pants are double lined. I will nice. say that because the holes go yeah. through. Yeah. Like on Santi's, if you look really close, like you can see his, like the skin on his shoulder, but you can't see his chest. I'm wondering uh, yeah. if he's wearing something under it or um, if he's wearing like a tank top or something, but the pants are double lined. So I can see the holes. Yeah. Like you can't see through them, but yeah. they're there. And I think that's what, like you said, you can see the holes, but I don't think you can see like mm -hmm. skin per yeah. se. Yeah. But so. I think the tops, you can see skin. Uh, got, oh, yeah. Now I see on that pink one, it is. And they have, and they have t shirts as well, too. Hmm. So the whole collection. The t shirt is $75. So I should have known this wasn't a regular Nike hoodie because Santi has been like designer, designer boy. He has. He's looked so good this year. He has. So shout out to Santi, man. Shout, shout out to, out to Santi. Santi. Oh, yeah. Uh, okay, let's take a quick break. When we come back, we're going to have a special shoe in hand, an exclusive look for you. We're going to talk about a couple visitor shoes that yes. were here over, <laughs> I guess, last week. Yeah. Um, we'll talk about our fits. We'll talk about some really weird ass shoes. That I, whatever. We'll be right back. <laughs> <laughs> you saw with four seconds for the win. Yes! Marcus. One of the more competitive people you'll meet. Yeah, you lose. That willingness to go out and try to compete every day, not just wait for a game, not wait for a regular season game, not wait for a playoff game, but every day is what made Mark special. He was a big part of that identity, right? And a big part of that's why the, the team was so successful because they had that anchor in him. The Grizzlies to this day wouldn't be the Grizzlies without the contribution of Marcus Gasol. There was some sad news coming out of the WWE. Michael Jones, also known as Virgil, passed away. He's a Virginia Union alum, so he graduated from an HBCU. He got his start in Memphis, right? Oh man, you're absolutely right. He started in Memphis in 1985. Get all of your HBCU sports and culture news by tuning in to HBCU Huddle with CJ Hurt and Mike Wallace. New episodes drop every Thursday on GrindCityMedia.com, YouTube, and Spotify. Real country music with Cody Johnson live Saturday, April 13th at FedEx Forum. Country's best. The Leather Tour with Cody Johnson with special guest Justin Moore. Also featuring Drake Milligan. VIP and reserve seats on sale at Ticketmaster.com in the FedEx Forum box office. Cody Johnson. Did I invent this, Loki? Did you? I spent years calling my ex-producer, Cowboy Carson, and now Beyonce. She Didn't decides she, she, wants wind? To, she wants to dabble in country, in the genre. Now she's calling her album Cowboy Carter. When she's doing her next concert, That's and right. she says, hey, my new album's about to come out, uh, inspired. Cowboy Carter. I inspired just, by The Gary Parish Show. Shout out GP in yeah. Memphis. The Gary Parish Show, live weekdays at 10 a.m. on YouTube at Grind City Media and the official Grind City Media app. Best show, everybody. I am Kelsey. 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 No, I am excited um, <laughs> about this segment because one of my favorites is that our guys are so connected, so hooked up, so in tune with the sneaker world. They always have really fun and exciting exclusive shoes to bring into the studio that otherwise I would never get a chance to see or feel or look at. Before we get to that, we're gonna do, um, you guys were at a game last week. Yep. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And you took a couple of pictures of some of the shoes mm -hmm. that opposite players were wearing, or opposing players, opposite, opposing <laughs> players, um, <laughs> and some of our players. Yeah. And you put a poll up on Instagram. Make sure you're following along on Instagram. It is uh, at Sneak Fest. Yep. So let's pull up 
the initial picture. So oh, it's yeah. Gigi up top, mm -hmm. Rui over there on the right in the orange, Brandon mm -hmm. Clark on the very bottom, then Austin Reeves. You guys should have tried to get a uh, Dinwiddie. He wears his own shoe, doesn't he? Yeah, I think he's like 30, 361 degrees. Yeah. Is that the name of the shoe? Mm -hmm. Oh. he's. Anyway, I don't know that. why I know that. I was about to say that. How did you, how did you know that? Because I remember he was on a show and he promoted so it. So this is Austin. Yeah. Yeah, that's his shoe. Yeah, that's Austin's yeah. shoe. Yeah. He viewed the story, actually. Did he? Yeah. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay, Austin. Okay. He didn't even vote for himself. That would have been cool if he did. <laughs> okay, before we get to the results, where would your votes have gone? <clears throat> Bennett, including you. Gigi. I would definitely win Gigi. Those answers are nice. Those Kyries are definitely nice. I, I, I want a pair. I tried to get my daughter to go get me a pair when they had the sneaker politics uh, release, but sh she wouldn't go down So this there. is the shoe you were saying. He usually wears serious player only. Correct. Mm -hmm. Just in the warm-up and then in the first quarter, you said? It was either yeah. the first quarter first or first half. half. One this of is them. like the new Kyrie. Remember the yeah. whole drama that Kyrie mm -hmm. is no longer with Nike? He's right. now with Anta. So this is one of his... Kyrie. That's his first. That's, that's his first. His very first, first, yeah. first shoe release. Very cool that yep. Gigi even has it. Exactly. So both of your votes would have gone to Gigi. I wonder with Gigi. Gigi. Yeah, I wonder with Gigi. Uh, BC. BC. Yeah. Wow, that is Homer. the most boring. And you can't really. I'm, I'm, a, I'm a plain guy. That but you, is a but, but I'm a plain kind of guy. On that KD that uh, BC has on, it's a print. It's really it's a print on there. You can't really tell by the because it's so dark. Is on every single one of them. I don't think it's That's on all of them. That's a pretty boring shoe. It is? Sure. Oh, okay. Come on. But it was BC first game back, so, you know, yeah, we had to yeah. show love. He, he, right. he went with what was, what was coming. All right, let's him, see what so. the results yeah. are. Bing! GG. Okay, GG. Okay, That's are 6%. you guys surprised Austin didn't that Austin even didn't vote didn't for get, himself? He didn't vote for himself. He didn't get himself. any love. Not his own shoe. So, I don't they think don't. people know know what his shoe is. Like They, they don't, don't look like a bad basketball they shoe. They don't. But, you know. Maybe maybe it's a bad matchup. You know how we say that all the time. <laughs> bad matchup. Kick, bad matchup. Bad matchup. Hey, BC got twelve percent, so he got some love. That that's shout out to BC. It was just Bennett on all his, his and his burner accounts. That's right. Yeah, <laughs> on all of them. <laughs> and uh, what's called chain shoes? And the he warmed up in really? these. But he, yeah, he came out yeah, he, in something different. Yeah. He came out in in this. It was a Jordan, but he He's came out a different athlete, color. Yeah, he so. came out a different color. So shout out to Gigi, man. Shout out Gigi. Congratulations, Gigi. Yeah. Uh, all right, it's time for one of my favorite parts. It is an exclusive look at a pair of shoes that Sherman brought in. So, Sherm, I'll throw it over to you. What do you got for us today? Happy Tuesday. Uh, like Kelsey said, we always like to bring in some unreleased shoes, some shoes that have released or they are celebrating an anniversary shoe. And today we are looking at a shoe that at I once, want this shoe. once he, I had, to go for him. he had some controversy going on with him. Uh, even with this release, there was a lot of backlash behind because they was like, how he's going to do a release. Uh, it was made out of his dad's rookie's cards, and you're going to see that inside the shoe. And what I'm talking about right now is the Trophy Room Air Jordan 1 Low. This is the uh, rookie card away. Uh, just to take a look at the box a little bit. The box is actually nice. Um, it has the 1985 Air Jordan 1 uh, tag on here. Um, it's kind of made like his rookie card a little bit. Like if it faded like away. Like it's kind of faded away. It has the Trophy Room logo right here with the Michael Jordan signature, his dad's signature right here. Uh, one thing Jerry pointed out, I didn't notice. Cause I literally, this is my first, the same thing. This is my first time looking at this shoe. I took it out the shipping box and just, just brought right it straight here. here. The, the tag on it is cricket. It is. So if it's trying to get authenticated, it's it like how... See, with that so pass maybe, because of maybe that. Maybe somebody that. like, yeah, sees like Rome. She might see something like right. that very often. So she's like, you know what? I this know how it's supposed to be. Yeah, they just, to be. they just threw it on there. Like you can see it. It's not, it's not on there at all. Like, like Jerry pointed out, it's super crazy. But yeah, yeah this is my size, the size package, eight. You know? uh, it has, it has Air Jordan 1 Retro Low OG SP on there. The colorway has Cell Black, Varsity Red, uh, and whatever other colors on here. But let me take a look at the box. Inside, uh, Chicago skyline, skyline of Chicago with the Michael Jordan Jumpman on there. Uh, Nike check, like other little stuff you can verify to make sure that it's legit with the numbers and all that stuff. Um, and then this is the actual uh, when the rookie card. I, I know Bennett, Bennett probably know about that. The, the rookie card look right there. It was from what was the uh, name of the cards back then? Uh, was it Fleer? Rosa told me earlier. Fleer. What's the name of it? Fleer. Fleer. Yeah, 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 yeah. So that's the how the rookie card used to look, 1985. Which their rookie card right now of Jordan is really worth a lot of money. Taking it out the box, 
just slides literally right on that. Brandy. Literally takes that's, it out of the box. That's a lot. Yes. So this plastic wasn't on the outside of the box? No. This is, ex- this you, is this your this, first time This is opening. my first time opening this box up. Inside the box, same thing. Jordan Signature with the uh, Trophy Room logo on the, in the inside of it. Uh, and now, take it out of the out of this box. You got your Trophy Room one? Yes, I want them. And it I comes with uh, extra lace, which is a yellow. These are yellow color laces that it comes with. Uh, I'm going to pass that around and then I'm going to take this one out so we can take a look at it some more. So Trophy Room 1, uh, this is the Ricky Car Away. Uh, some of the material on here around this red part right here is like a satin uh, type of material. Um, the top of it is kind of like suavish a little bit. It's real. The, the top and the side is like suavish. Uh, the back part, uh, what, what, what you could say about that material chair back down the back? This is like, like a, a woven, woven, like woven type of material, like a woven type of material on the back side. It has the uh, gold uh, uh, jump man wings. How on do the I back. get the shoe? Woo. Now you gotta pay resale. Now, now you so, gotta pay resale yeah. for it. And I actually, I actually hit on shoe. Trophy Room site. Uh, that he sent the link out. I went on there, uh, put in for it, and the shoe's it, sick. I got yeah. the email saying congratulations, shoe. you won. And this shoe yeah. is sick. And I see. It really sick. It smells good too. This is one, of, and it has a Trophy Room logo uh, right here as well too on the red side. This is. I was looking at stuff releasing this year, and I was like, this is one There's of my top releases. Threads. I yeah. think your girl would. Uh... What's that? Oh. <laughs> this is one of my top releases. I said I wanted to get my hands on. I was actually happy that I was like, I, I like to get my hands on. And what's funny is, so I can't get this now. You, you can. can. You gotta pay. You gotta pay resale for it. Hit your Jordan rep. Maybe you can get. Yeah, them. hit your Jordan rep. And it's funny because we J- Jolly was about to Jolly Rose was about to leave out, and he he ran by a table, and someone had a size thirteen, and his size for five hundred. Oh, he, he bought them. Yeah, he oh, at the very end. That, that last yep. table, he was ready to leave on now. Yep. No, no, these are fire. At, you got this at regular price. Regular price. Oh, yeah. the materials are cool. Yeah, the materials are nice. And then that's the insole, uh, the ins- yours is blue and, and mine's is yellow. It's a good comfy insole. You think too. that's yellow? You would consider that yellow? E- lime green, yellowish. That's yellow. Yellow. You think that's yellow? Yeah. It's like a you neon. Think that's that looks a little green to me. Yeah. <laughs> that it's looks like a little yellow. greenish like to me. Neon yellow. It's like a neon yellow. I disagree what wholeheartedly. The, where I think that's green. Where's right Yellow shoe string. Let's see. It's a good shoe. I'm a fan. That's not the same? No. A little bit? <laughs> I mean, it's like, nah. that's, that's green to me. That looks green to me. Well, it, it's somewhere in that family colorway. Can so, you hold yeah. it up? I need the chat to, like, that looks like, that. that's very green to I know, me. this is like chat. the dress. What is this? Is this yellow or green? It might look different because of the light hitting it. Mm. What the chat is saying. It, yeah, it does look a little different. So That's yeah. green. Again, this is my. What color is a tennis ball? Huh? Um, to you, what color is a tennis ball? Yellow. Yellow? Yellow. Or yeah. green. It's yellow to me. It's not yellow. What color is a tennis ball? Yellow. Yeah. Yeah. But that looks green to me. It looks green. Give it's me like, that. Can it give me that uh, highlighter beside you? It's like a neon, like a neon green. What the chat saying? That's let's a see yellow the, highlighter. Let's see what the chat saying. That's a yellow highlighter. It's a yellow highlighter. Put this next to that. Uh, Nick said it's like a bright oh, sun. Oh, okay. It's like a bright sunshine yellow. I yellow. think it's specific. That's yellow. That's green. That's yellow. Sharpie makes a green one that's green. That is that's yellow. green. <laughs> I'm lost. <laughs> See? Even okay, the, but Xavier said based on light, more green than yellow. Demaria the, the said a yellow. Uh, Rick said it's a highlighter. So I can, that's, uh, I can see that. I mean, that's what this is, is a highlighter. So, you know what I mean? In the end, the shoe is fine. <laughs> That's something we can all agree yeah, on. Yeah, this shoe, this shoe is clean. Like for as of right now, I might of, go pay resale. For as me. of right now, of April the second of two thousand twenty-four. Those are yellow to you guys. These are green. It is. <laughs> it is yellow to me. As of yeah. right now, of two thousand and twenty-four of April the second, I'm I'm naming this my sneaker of the year as of right now because I hadn't really seen anything else that they knew, come in yellow and. Jobs. and Green, green tennis balls. Yes. So there are green tennis balls. And then there's another colorway too. Uh, this is the <laughs> away, but he has a home one. And I think that's like a family and friends. So I hadn't seen nobody with that one yet, but oh, these are clean. Okay. Here's my thing. Oh, it has Michael Jordan's signature right here too. I didn't see that. If I owned these, yeah. uh-huh. Jordan ones, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. If I owned these Jordan ones, 
I don't think I could ever wear another pair of Jordan 1s. Because this material is so much better that than every is, Jordan yeah. I've ever felt. Like, I feel like every other Jordan 1 is inferior to this shoe. Yeah. But this is beautiful. Yeah, that's a good shoe. So, I didn't know. It, so, it comes with two more lace. I mean, another lace. comes with a white and a yellow. Green. And then... <laughs> 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 yellow, green, depending on what color you want to look at. It depends on who you time. ask. Yeah, depending this on who you shoe, ask. This like, shoe, I don't think you can, like, get it. No. Nah. I didn't... Um, this is... So, this so is, when I first like, saw them online, so I didn't, soft. I didn't mind them, but I don't want them. Yeah. So, Trophy Room released them a week before they released on sneakers. So, mm. so Mark has released them first, and he did an in store. Uh, I know Retrograde went down to Orlando to the store and actually and bought them. He signed the box and stuff for him. But I actually hit on Retrograde or Retro Store. Like, retro Store, man. Retro this Store. This is yeah. so yeah. beautiful. Yeah. But this you know, the, this is the first shoe I've held in my hand. I've been like. You're stunning. Yeah, just just even listen to <laughs> Marcus so when soft. he was talking about this shoe on uh, Full Size Run. He was just like, "It's a good shoe." He was just like the you like he, his no? hands on 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 the material wise when he when he do all his releases. Mm -hmm. He makes sure he put the top quality on there. I legit when I saw him online, I wasn't a fan, but I'm a fan of him now. Yeah, no, these are these are fire. I would, I think out of all his, ten out of ten. I agree. Ten out out of all the trophy room releases, this I don't this. Out of all the trophy room release, this is the best. This you is the best be release. 50s. This is the best release. Kayla probably can. She wore the same size as me. Oh, yeah, uh, you no. got like a whole size. That's a whole yeah. size of difference. I can wear thick socks. That is true. Pass me that one. Double it up. <laughs> She's not giving it back. <laughs> Don't you think too that that's just going to be a hot commodity because it's the rookie just card? The like rookie you're going to have yep. card collectors that want these shoes. Exactly. It might not I'll even be sneakerheads. Yeah. yeah. No, I'll take it. You can have the box. You can have that little premium issue thing. You can have it all. <laughs> I just want this shoe. Yeah, it's it's fire. Do they no, sell it on fire. Shein? <laughs> if they are, do not buy it from Mom Shein. <laughs> I thought you learned your lesson. I know. But no, these are fire. These no, these are fine. Like, I love them. Yes. I know you went through material, but I don't know if you, like, did it right. I probably did. <laughs> I mean, because we were just so excited about Even, it. Even, like, I mean, this is cream yeah. colored and uh -huh. not white. And this is, like, the most like the soft faded. suede ever. I did. The, the back, tongue is a different tongue. material, too. It's, like, not your yeah, normal it. tongue. No, it's I mean, it got the OG, the OG Nike Air tongue on there. I don't like uh, it. I don't like how much I like it. <laughs> Even though I, I don't like how much I like it. Even said, I do I say you got the Jordan signature right and here? Don't, aren't you not it. a fan of red shoes? No, I hate red's my least favorite color in the world. But these are there's a difference. That's yeah. like satin. That's a good I, shoe. I hate that shoe. What's like funny is when he it. first said he was gonna make a low and all the fake factories were making a low of what he uh, yeah. previously made. And I bet you that gave him a kick. <laughs> Like these people just don't know. Shout out to shout out to uh, Marcus, Marcus in the trophy room, man. On on these good release again. This is so I'm far. Pissed. So far, 2024 as of April the second. <laughs> I'm voting this as my sneaker of the year for <laughs> now. I'm just saying for now, people. <laughs> Someone's pouty. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> good pickup. Good pickup for me this Let year. Me look up. Okay, I'm gonna do research and see how much money I need to save before I get them. And okay. Jordan's gonna tell me what he's got on today. All right. Again, happy Tuesday. Up top. Uh, again, shout out to all the vendors who had sneak fest. Uh, what I'm wearing up top is one of the vendors that we had. Uh, he was a, I can't say he was a young kid, but he was a younger kid than me because I'm 41. But he just started his own clothing brand, and it's a Kristen Brace clothing brand. It's uh, called uh, Crown uh, Crown Apparel and Clothing. Uh, what I'm rocking up top is his uh, Jesus World Tour uh, t-shirt. $400. That's not bad. Oh, I want, uh. that's, that's not bad. I would expect more than that, but that's not bad at all. $400? Yes. You got it. You got it. Don't worry about it. Well, we, we just talked about it. Me, you, and Benny just talked about what you just did. Yeah, my point is that. Anyway, I'm rocking. Uh, shout out to Crown, uh, to Crown Clothing, man. Appreciate the hookup on the T. On my thighs, I am rocking Richard Lee. Uh, cargo pants. Uh, these are probably one of my favorites right now. They're like super comfortable. And it's so funny how I told you about Richard you Lee. You did. And I still never buy anything like from Jerry, Richard Lee. Jerry put me on Richard Lee and it's like, I, before he started making clothes, you put me on him and he yeah. was just doing YouTube videos and then he started his own clothing brand and went from there. And on my thighs, I'm probably rocking uh, one of my favorites as of right now and these are the ASIC. Your, th your uh, toes. Huh? On your toes. On my toes and my thighs. My bad. Thanks, Jerry. He threw me off to my Richard Lee. On my toes, I'm rocking the A6 uh, Keanu 14s. These are the the Prudel and whatever other colorway. It's like a cream colorway or something like that. So, yeah. Favorite one. So, that's what I'm rocking on this Tuesday. 
Jerry, what you rocking, Jerry? Uh, this is really <laughs> not one of my favorite outfits ever. Uh, I know. It's just a baked t-shirt. Because Kelsey gave you all thumbs down. You know, and it, it made I, me feel some sort of way. I was laughing out loud. <laughs> some sort of way. I don't like it. I you. was laughing out loud. So they send me their their pictures outfits. of what they're going to wear so I can send uh-huh. it into the team downstairs. And I thumbs down everything. Everything. Right. Everything. everything I got on everything. I didn't even say anything. I just said thumbs down. <laughs> And I feel that way too. Honestly, I said mm, this T-shirt thumbs down. Yeah. Oh, those shoes thumbs down. <laughs> but yeah, it's a. And then he gave me like a, a side face. Um, I said thumbs down. Oh man! <laughs> and then I got to return the favor later. I thumbs down everything you did. <laughs> <laughs> um, but that's neither here or there. This is a bait. I think it's Singapore is the country that this shirt released in. It's okay. their seventh anniversary shirt. It's it like got a some on the back jersey. side. Yeah, okay. Like, it just says seven on the back. Bathing, bathing a bathing ape. ape. And it's um, Nike sweat shorts. And these on my toes are the Nike Air Max 97 Soul. Like Korea, so I know this is fire. That's yeah. cool. Yeah, I do like fire. the color. I think you got them from the, the clearance store, didn't it? You get them from I hit on these um, on one of the Air Max days. I oh, think. Okay, yeah, that's a nice outfit. Yeah, good outfit it's for okay. today. That's not my favorite outfit. It's okay. It, it was a long weekend, so that's one of yeah. them long weekend outfits. I went through. I went through some stuff in my folders. And I said, okay, I'm going to just piece an outfit together. Well, I did the same my- thing. I just so happened had this T-shirt that I bought, yeah. so I'm like, I'm just going to yeah, put something exactly already right So I'm a size six and a half, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Men's? And, mm-hmm. Men's, yeah. You making that call? How much you looking? How much they are? $392. That's not bad. $392. The jeans you just showed me are about the same price. <laughs> exactly. Uh. What you, you just told me and Benny what you just did earlier, so. Yeah. This is it's, it. it's way cheaper than that. Do it, do it. I really love them. <laughs> Cause what you're rocking today? Wear red shoes, no, right? Someone talking. But they just not no, red. They you can wear red shoes or anything. That they are. Those, these shoes will go good with Sherman's outfit now, even though he don't got no red. It is true. It, it will go with you got on too. Yeah. Oh. Uh oh. Peer pressure. Do yeah. Well, speaking. What Peer do you pressure. have on? What you got on, okay. Kelsey? Okay. Today what you got I'm on? wearing a Marcusol T-shirt because it's the last time I'm going to be on Fire. air. Before his retirement, yes. shout out to Mark. Chris Vernon on Thursday. Yeah, um, this is the same brand. This lovely gentleman sent it to me. The same brand of that T-shirt with me and Jaw on it mm-hmm. that everyone went bananas for. Um, <laughs> the, so it's the same the, brand. The viral pick. He's doing the little Conor McGregor. Um, I remember that? watching that game. That's that's a fire T-shirt. Yeah, that's, that's, that's a cool. good T-shirt. Yeah. T-shirts are very thick. Um, the Instagram, if you're interested, is Vintage Future underscore Shop. Yeah, it's where. The guy has he the jaw t-shirts there, the t-shirts there. Yeah, you can buy it. Is it someone on the back? No. Is well, right? I think like the name. Okay, think, okay. Like, just the Instagram okay. handle. Um, I'm wearing a pair of jeans, and I'm wearing. Hold on, don't just I'm wearing a pair of jeans from Amazon. Quit acting like those. Just <laughs> 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 she she don't want to flex on those, but it's okay. Keep going. Don't tell Sherman after. <laughs> Keep going. Yeah. And a pair of Jordan 11s. These are the ones. These are like the first ones that Sherman, Sherman got for you. Got me. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yep. Midnight Navy something. What is it called? Is it Midnight Navy? Something like they're that. They're really nice yeah. too, actually. You know yeah, what? Yeah. I'm like, I'm being a baby right now, but they're like really nice. They're velvet. Yeah. Like the material is super nice on these as well. Yeah, those I'm are just, clean. I'm just being a baby because Sherman has the shoes across <laughs> the studio for me that I've like fallen in love with and they're just sitting there. <laughs> I feel like an idiot. He has them just in front of me and I'm just sad. Yeah, and they didn't, you could have got them because they, they were a website release that they were on sneakers. website release shut up on, yeah. on, that's why i got these from off his off his way well, he released on his website yeah, you didn't first. have to get on sneakers to get them and then a week later they released on sneakers i don't know if i would have liked them if i just saw them online yeah that's all i'm saying i when think I that's how yeah. i want a fan yeah okay well do it we only have do seven it. minutes do left for the show we need another break all i right. need to they're gonna come back from break and they're gonna have black <laughs> eyes because i'm just mad that those are here right now because i love them so much go to break go to break <laughs> Nate Barkanti, the Be Funny Tour. I mean, Chuck E. Cheese is rough. I don't know if you've been there in a while. They look like they're trying to go to business and they can't. All new material. They filed for bankruptcy and they're still open. They called Blockbuster and they're like, how do you get out? We want out. Nate Barkanti, Friday, May 31st, FedEx Forum. Tickets available at FedEx Forum Box Office or Ticketmaster.com. Produced by Outback Presents. Nate Barkanti, the Be Funny Tour. Vince Williams is going to go to All-Star Weekend. 
Now, what a great thing for him. Kudos to, to Vince Williams Jr. You know, um, he was an injury replacement on the Panini Rising Stars. He'll get a chance to be part of the All-Star Weekend Showcase. Hey, Grizzlies fans, be sure to tune in to Grisby, where the panel and I break down all things Grizzlies and take a look at the rest of the NBA as well. The show is live every Wednesday, 2 p.m. on YouTube at Grind City Media and the official Grind City Media app. You saw with four seconds for the win. Yes! Marcus, one of the more competitive people you'll meet. Yeah, you lose. That willingness to go out and try to compete every day, not just wait for a game, not wait for a regular season game, not wait for a playoff game, but every day is what made Mark special. He was a big part of that identity, right? And a big part of that's why the, the team was so successful because they had that anchor in him. The Grizzlies, to this day, wouldn't be the Grizzlies without the contribution of Marcus Gasol. Did you do anything in that St. Joe's game? No, I was strictly playing defense. Delonte West was tough. That's a pro. Oh, my God. That step back. And that oh, wait, hold on. 40 minutes. You didn't even get a rest. No, I you played, played the whole 40. game. Six for 11 from the field. That was me. 12 points, six rebounds, five assists. Oh, I was nice that game. <laughs> I thought I ain't getting double figures. The Chris Vernon Show, presented by Caesar Sportsbook, live weekdays at noon on YouTube at Grind City Media and the official Grind City Media app. Back into the sneak fest show. I'm still really mad because I want those freaking shoes. Do it, do it, do um, it. Um, okay, we have two things that I want to get to really quick. Yes. One thing is like low-key important, so I don't want to cut it from the show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that is the fact that Nike execs, whoever, right, have come out mm-hmm. and been like, hey, we know that you guys love the really popular shoes that we've been making forever, the shoes oh. that everyone wears, the shoes that are, are widely available, the shoes that people oh buy over and over and over and over and over and over it's been, and over. It's been a staple for forever. 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 Yeah. Because yeah. an easy shoe to wear with any outfit at mm. any time, no matter who you are, what style is, like yeah. whatever, yeah. is an Air Force One. Getting cut in half. This wasn't an April Fool's joke. This, this wasn't. This was not. This was real. So What's, they're saying that they'd want to they want to keep the integrity of the model of the shoe, so they feel a cut down from releasing so so many of them. Resellers, I love it. Resellers, I love it. They loving it right now, but they are hating this because this is cutting to their profits. Not really, because now they can drive whatever the the price. That's yeah, true. Up. I ain't think about that. Yeah. So it's not hurting them. But I mean, how do y'all feel about Nike? I mean, me, you don't. I can't say too much. So. I don't wear Air Forces. I but love Air Forces. For people who wear Air Forces, how do y'all feel about? I wouldn't even say I cut. wear Air Forces. I have a well, few pairs. Well, Sandra but, love you know. them. I really like Air Forces. Yeah, Sandra yeah. is a good, a big fan of them. I mean, there are, like you said, there are a lot of the, the rappers, like... Everyone. Everyone loves no, them. Like, you can even think... Yeah. Like, I think they just got to get to the drawing board. You can think about rappers, board. athletes. You can think about girls in Germantown High School. That is like, true. Like, this shoe is for everyone. It's for everybody. Yeah. Yeah, everyone. That's for everybody, yeah. They're definitely cutting these. They're saying that now... but They didn't want to burn it to the ground. That's all it is. But can you... But again, me not being a fan of Earth, not saying I'm not a fan of Earth, I just don't, yeah, I don't like, wear them. Do you get away? Do, do you do away with the staple? That's what I'm saying. Like, how like, did you burn? You superstars can't, I don't think are you, always going to be available. You can't burn Earth Force. You can't Sun burn Earth Force and Ground. But they're saying they want to take away the, the so much focus on the Earth Force to, to, to try to build up all the other products that they are releasing. So I'm like, but it I don't also know. could be, yeah, you know, Nike is very like, moved to zero. This could be them like, hey, we're not trying to make too much waste. And hey, everybody just make use of your shoes. It is true, too, because Air true. Forces are one of those shoes that people have like eight of them in your closet. Mm-hmm. Because when, they just, when one gets dirty, they're like, okay, I need a, I need a crisp Air right. Forces. Mm-hmm. And they'll just, throw them in, they'll just throw them away. I mean, some people will give them away, but majority of people Unless just you're throw a girl German in high school and then you wear it for about Just five cook years. them. Yeah. You just cook them for um, but. Yeah, so this is an interesting thing to keep in mind. And I think. We'll see if they're really, you that's know. That's what I'm saying. Like, moving yeah. forward, we'll, we'll be able to, yeah. to retouch yeah. on this subject, yeah, 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 I think, yeah. a lot. Because yeah. there'll obviously be more news because of how big this is. I mean, Nike is all about numbers. Mm-hmm. So they're going to see those numbers and be like, all right, you know what? 
we can't pull back from this because it's one of our big staple mm -hmm. number wise. So we'll see. We'll, we'll see, see over time. Yeah, we'll see over time. Uh, really quick before we go, there is one more one nine one collab of the season, and that is our good friend Zach Meyer. He could Zach, not be man. here today. I know we were yeah. texting, and yeah. he is just getting an award in Hollywood. Yeah. So Zach. couldn't make the show man. today. I do yeah. think he's on Chris Vernon on Friday. We have a couple of his pieces here. Um, I'll pass them to you guys. Just to give a quick shout out, if you know Zach, he is um, a loyal fan. He's a loyal, a loyal fan. fan. He's a big sneakerhead himself. Big sneakerhead. Huge sneakerhead. Yeah. He has yeah. his own Jordan deal. Yeah, has his own know. Jordan he's deal. He's very, very, Super very fan. cool. Yep. He's at most of the games when he's in town, um, and he designed his own collab here. So the t-shirt over there has the the beautiful land in the world. You know that guy who does the beautiful land in the world. You beautiful want to show the back, Sherm, yep. real quick? With the ooh, so the cool. These are just two of the pieces. I think there's about five or six different pieces. If you want to come to Jerry's camera now, this is the hoodie the with our guys, yes. of course. Super it says fire. live from FedEx Forum. It's kind, kind of, of like a concert tee. Yeah, yeah, because he's an artist. Exactly. So very cool. Um, you guys were talking about the material earlier, just yes. how nice it is. It's very comfort colors. And the tag. I said that the tag is orange and it low key. Can you hold that up again? The it tag low key is fire. gives like hair and Preston vibes. Yep, exactly. So I just wanted to give it a really quick shout out. This will be available Friday before Friday's game yep. um, against the Pistons. It is the last 191 collab. We love Zach Myers here in Memphis. Shout out to Zach, He got man. a key to the city when he performed here. So yes. come out and support him. It is our next home game against the Pistons Friday night. The This merch will be available Friday and only Friday, of course. Yep. Um, and Friday is Zach. I mean, uh, March. Saturday. Saturday. Oh, that's March. Saturday. So it's yeah. before that game. Yeah. yeah. Okay, okay. So you can buy this to work to that game. Perfect. Yeah. Support everything Memphis. And we will be back on Tuesday live, 2 p.m. right here. Get these shoes out of my face. I'm so I'm so done. <laughs> Bye. Laptop, please. Mm -hmm.